I got money, I got a freezer, I got three refrigerators, they're just in three different locations. That's my place, my mama's place, and my grandma's place. Cause I can just show up and dig out of them without asking for permission. Ah, oh, ain't nothing wrong with your health. I thought that was your style for the day. No, you didn't. <laughs> Okay, so I just got home. Yeah! Well, well I, got, I had just got home a little bit before that phone call, but I burned probably like I don't know how many calories a day. Went to the gym, went skating, and I did really good because I saw one of the finest girls I've ever seen in my life, and I didn't say anything to her. I got stuff I'm focusing on right now, like the grind, you know? This is pre-preparation for what's coming, y'all. Pre-preparation. A ton of people been, you know, were supposed to call me today. Some people randomly are calling me now and it's like 11.33. I had forgot, until I edited this vlog that I forgot that I saved till later, I forgot how to vlog. But now that I've jogged my memory by editing one and finishing one, I'm about to get a pop. But I'm about to hit the hay. So, whew, good, hey. Probably gonna open up these blinds a little bit, let a little bit of this morning light in. Today is I have no idea today because I do not know what I, I, I don't know what I'm doing. But here's one thing I always tell myself on days just like this. Today is gonna be an awesome day. Gonna be chill, paid a few bills. Hold on, no, that's not what I say. I say today is going to be an awesome day full of a ton of fun. I'm thinking about changing my shirt because it's hot outside and even worse, it's humid. I prefer hot over humid. So I'm probably gonna change my shirt. all the construction and stuff around the Greenville area. It's growing like gangbusters right now. Growing super, super crazy. What we are doing today? I was gonna go to the park, festival thing, because it's Labor Day. Mom called and she told me that it sucked. As you guys can see, I have changed my shirt. And the reason I changed my shirt is because it don't matter how hot it is, the black polka dotted one just looks better than the white one. I, that's, plus it's a little bit more airy. I noticed that the white one did deflect heat, but it was so thick that not only did I not feel comfortable wearing it style wise, but I didn't feel comfortable wearing it temperature feel wise. And I just went for a walk downtown. Um, nothing really interesting going on down there. I noticed that the parking was free. That was awesome. Like I said before, today's kind of much like a go with the flow kind of day. Go with the flow kind of day. So I'm not really sure what I'm gonna get into. I don't even know where I'm going right now. So when I find something funny or interesting, we'll be back to these mess. We'll, we'll be back with this message. I'm starting to notice that I am developing within myself a lead foot culture. I am starting to duplicate my grandfather and my mother because they are notorious for having lead feet. Out of most people in my family, my mom, my granddad, they get the, they've gotten the most, I'm not gonna speak that over them, they've gotten the most police tickets. And um, I've probably only gotten one for speeding. Um, I 
I'm trying to discipline myself a little bit more. Me and the speed limit have never gotten along. Every time I'm not looking at the speedometer, I happen to be at like 80 to 90 miles per hour in pH. 80 to 90 in pH. So, and I noticed that a lot of cars are either right beside me or keeping up with me. So therefore, I'm not the problem. I'm starting to realize it's two things. Either I am developing a super lead foot or my subconscious that keeps me in between the lines is following the cars and not the speed limit. So automatically due to association with other crazy drivers, I'm driving at ridiculous rates of speed. So at the end of the day, it's not really my fault. If you want to view it from that perspective. How are you doing, Mom? You don't want to be recorded? No. <laughs> My hair, I love my hair. Oh, ain't nothing wrong with your hair. I thought that was your style for today. No, you didn't. <laughs> hey, Jay on them. Hi. How you doing? Oh, good. How's school? Good. You want me to leave you alone? Yeah. <laughs> All right, mama. I'm about to dip. Dip? I'm dipping. I got 30 minutes to get over to Corey and Bailey's. Alrighty. Love you. Love you most. Is, 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 is. See you, Jalen. I mean, Jayana. <laughs> what? What? Okay, that's what I thought. So, obviously, my hands are going to be full for most of this ride, so I won't be able to hold my camera as much as I want. Uh, can barely even move this wheel. I gotta use my pinky because I'm holding this pizza my mama gave me. There's these popsicles I always eat from my mom's whenever I swing by, right? So I said, you know what? I'm gonna start buying these myself. Because I got money, I got a freezer, I got three refrigerators. They're just in three different locations. That's my place, my mama's place, and my grandma's place. Because I can just show up and dig out of them without asking for permission. I'm gonna go to the store, I'm gonna buy my popsicles, and I'm gonna go visit some friends. And then whatever else happens in between is whatever happens in between. And all my friends are probably gonna try to offer me food, but I gotta tell. Now, if it's something good, I might tell them something different. But if it's something not so good, nah, I'm just be disciplined and turn it down. I already had pizza, I've been doing pretty well um, in the gym, which is where you're gonna see me more often. But. I'm gonna stop talking and I'm gonna stay posted. And onward to the homie's place. Whoa! I don't know if I should go. The thing is like, whoa, it's broken. Somebody broke it again. Because before, somebody had broke the thing off of the gate. They put it back on there and it looks like somebody broke it again, but this time it's not broken off. <laughs> So here's what happened. I have a bad habit of not keeping a charger in my car. My phone died. I know there's a lot of randomness going on in this vlog. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. It wasn't my phone, it was my camera. My camera keeps dying when I'm out and about. I'm literally splicing completely different days together. Moving on from me trying to get to that apartment, I get invited to this fundraiser by a friend of mine named Jared. I've known this guy for a while. It turns out he's a whole lot bigger than I expected. Going to this party, shindig. Pop outside a ghost and hop up in a fan on. Give me a taste of what it's gonna be like, cause I'm not really like there there yet to associate with um, lots of different industry people and people just, just on that level of higher tier lifestyle, a little bit above high class. It really normalized things for me, so. I'm really glad he invited me there. It was really good food, real good association. Got a couple contacts and made some connections. It was really fun. But um, I think I'm gonna close things out here. My camera's about to die again, even though it's on the charger right now. Appreciate you guys for watching. Till next time, maybe tomorrow, maybe today. Hmm, another hour, who knows? Make sure y'all turn on your post notifications so you don't miss anything. 
meaning hit the bell when you subscribe to this channel and become a part of the Double TMN fam. So it's always good to see you guys. Till the next video, I holla. Peace.